This is the Weather Extreme video. This is for Monday, the 8th of October. I am James Spann. A cloudy, gray, cool, damp day. A little light rain or drizzle today. Not exactly a Chamber of Commerce day, if you will. Let's check some of the Skycam shots around the network early this morning at uh, about 5 o'clock. That's the uh, traffic along US 280. Not much of it at 5 o'clock as seen from the Wingate Inn in Shelby County. Here's the Tuscaloosa Sky Cam overlooking, uh, overlooking Lurleen B. Wallace Boulevard. And a look at downtown Birmingham. It's cloudy and cool. Temperatures mostly in the 40s, and it's raining in spots. Look at that. Uh, that's the radar at 5.03. In fact, that's moderate rain falling up in parts of uh, Franklin, Colbert, and Lauderdale counties. Touch of moderate rain near the Tennessee River south of Huntsville. Patchy light rain from Fayette to almost Scottsboro. And needless to say, with the radar looking like that, we'll need to mention a chance of light rain at times today, especially during the morning hours. And the rain is due to this, this upper trough. You know, last week we had expected the sky to be clear this morning with the 30s and low 40s. But no, with the clouds, it's not as cold, but it's also uh, a bit wet. And once that trough axis moves east of the state, that's when the sky will finally brighten. Here's a look at the numbers this morning. Uh, again, mostly 40s from Birmingham north and 50s down to the south, Birmingham at 49. And we're not going to rise much today with the clouds. Uh, I don't think we get out of the 50s for uh, Birmingham, Tuscaloosa, Anniston, Gadsden, then 60s down to the south. And around the nation, uh, pretty cold with a lot of 30s just north and west of here where the sky is clear. Got a lot of uh, frost and freeze advisories this morning all the way from uh, Lubbock and Abilene, Texas to interior parts of New York. Pretty early in the season for that. Note, uh, note that Oklahoma City hit freezing this morning. That's the earliest they've ever seen freezing. Tulsa did that yesterday. Uh, rain for the next five days, not very much. In fact, really after today, the chance of rain just very tiny for the next seven days. This is valid through Friday evening at 7 o'clock. And keep in mind, this is still hurricane season. A couple of weak systems out there, but nothing expected to organize. We'll check modeling. This is the OZGFS valid at uh, 1 o'clock this afternoon at 500 millibars. There's your trough coming through. Down below that, clouds, a little light rain. We might see a, a ray of sun later today over northwest Alabama, but, but I think most places will be socked in with low clouds. But tomorrow, yes, a brighter day and a warmer day. Uh, again, as we uh, get out of the uh, Clouds, temperatures will likely reach the uh, low 70s, maybe upper 60s in spots. Both models are showing 71. And again, we start the day way down in the 40s, and I think the colder spots easily go in the 30s. Just maybe a touch of light frost for some of the colder pockets early in the day. Wednesday, mid-70s are likely as the warm-up continues. There's Thursday. We're still dry and pleasant with highs in the 70s. Looks like a little... Maybe a wedging type thing going on there, but still a very nice day. Uh, Friday, evidence of a front north of here, but I think that front might have a hard time reaching us. And the thickness values are going up. I think we'll be close to 80 on Friday afternoon as temperatures get back to where they should be. We should be in the upper 70s this time of the year. And there's Saturday as we start the weekend. Look at the ridge, a 588 ridge across Alabama. That should mean a warm day and a very powerful shortwave out there across the uh, heartland. And uh, down below that, uh, we should be dry with uh, low 80s on Saturday. And then Sunday, the uh, surface low with that strong disturbance is over the UP of Michigan with a trailing front. And you might consider just the chance of a shower Sunday evening. But with that upper ridge, if it rains, it should not rain very much. So the bottom line is most of the weekend should be dry and relatively warm with highs at or just over 80. And then a week from today, that's Monday of next week, same thing. Looks warm and dry with a high close to 80. Check the end of the forecast. Hey, that's cold. October 23rd. Uh, that's suggesting a big trough over the east and cold air again spilling southward. Looks awfully cold for this early in the season. And speaking of cold, look at the uh, cold records over the past seven days. Goodness, that's a bunch of them. I mean, we've got uh, uh, earliest snow of the season in a lot of places. You've got uh, lowest high temperatures. Record lows all over the board. So for the cold weather fans, your time is here. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog. Next video here by 3.30 or so today. And don't forget to catch us on television this evening, ABC 3340 in Birmingham at 4, 5, 6, and 10 on the TV or the live stream. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless.